Well, the team at Pyology in Roseville is rallying together to help a fellow employee. This is awesome. Ashley Williams is live with the story and also how you can help, too. Hey, Ash. Hi, guys. Good morning. You know, this really is truly an incredible story, but also maybe get ready to have those tissues in hand, ready to go. Um, this is Manny. Manny is the general manager here at Pyology. Manny, good morning to you. Good morning. Hello, hello. We really wanted to share this story, and really, guys, this really is a true testament to how important your coworkers really are. Uh, so what the story here is your employee, Chris, Chris, recently suffered a stroke and became paralyzed from the, the neck down. And you guys are doing all you can to help out. Yep. So we've got a uh, fundraiser that we're going to be doing next Tuesday um, from 4 to 8 to raise funds for Chris. 20% will go to Chris and uh, hopefully help him out in this time of need. Yeah, certainly. So we're going to go ahead and show some photos because we want to learn just a little bit more of Chris. If we can, show some of these pictures here. Uh, Manny, tell me about your relationship with Chris. So Chris is one of those people that kind of light up the store when he walks in the door. He's got a real quirky, act, uh, positive attitude and uh, was a great asset when he was here. A real hard worker, uh, dedicated to his job. He loved being here. We loved having him and uh, he's truly missed. Yeah, and, and you know, you were telling me just a little bit more too about um, how he was working for you and he left for something different, but unfortunately because of the pandemic, that didn't last, yet he still came back to you asking for a job and you were more than willing to, to get, get him back into your store. Oh yeah, without a doubt. Chris actually had an opportunity to do something a little bit better and, you know, more towards his uh, uh, field of study. And uh, we were, you know, uh, wishing him the best and then the pandemic hit and then he came back. So, um, you know, it was a no brainer. He called me and I said, no problem. You know, when can you start? So it was great That's to awesome. have him back. Yeah, he truly seems like an incredible guy. We saw those pictures there. You see that bright smile on his face. How is he doing now? He's doing good with all the circumstances, um, trying to stay positive, you know. Um, in uh, one conversation, you know, he said, you know, he's happy that he's got his uh, brain and uh, um, he's getting better. So that was really, truly good to hear. Yeah, really, truly finding the silver lining there. So grateful for you for sharing Chris's story. And hopefully Chris is watching now. Um, all that to say, guys, here's a good example of some great dishes that you offer. Who doesn't love a good pie? But again, Ooh. this is a big fundraising event that you guys are doing when? It's going to be uh, next Tuesday, February 23rd from 4 to 8 at uh, the Roseville Pyology at 2030 Douglas Boulevard. Okay, and again, a portion of those proceeds going back to Chris and really anything and everything that he might need help with, whether it's medical bills or just anything pertaining to his personal life. Yeah, and uh, we've had actually a couple businesses in the area that have donated um, some uh, gift certificates and uh, we're going to be doing a raffle. Oh, so awesome. we want to say thank you to Fitness 19 on Antelope Boulevard, on, in Antelope and Pleasant Point Dental in Roseville amongst a bunch of different other businesses. Right on. Uh, Manny, thank you so much. Really just such a great, truly a great story. And it's, you know, it's bittersweet. It's so difficult to understand exactly what sure. Chris might be going through, but how great is it that their coworkers are stepping in to really do anything yeah. that they can to help him out. So come on down. The information there on your screen, we'll make sure to put it on our website, gooddaysacramento.com. Um, and at the end of the day, this is some good food, good pizza. So right? Right, it's a win-win, really, right, truly. Win-win. Yeah. All right, guys, back on over to you. I think the Dabkovich family might have to have an impromptu Tuesday night pizza night. There you go. For that. There you yeah. go. Chris's family.